I appreciate Mr. Moore because even though he's a new teacher in a new environment, um, he's always ready to teach us and he's so enthusiastic about it. And he always emails us to, like to help us on assignments or whenever there's been a change in a procedure for a lab. Always helping us out. So thanks, Mr. Moore. I appreciate Mr. Moore because he's funny, um, he's enthusiast enthusiastic, uh, he cares about his students, and he does really cool experiments. Uh, even though I don't have them now, I used to have them, and he was pretty fun back then. So, I appreciate Mr. Moore because he teaches us so much about chemistry and um, actually saved the chem class, so thanks, Mr. Moore. Yeah. Okay, so Mr. Curtis is like a really good teacher. He makes sure you understand everything, and he's always worried about how you're doing, and I think that's really good of a teacher. And even if he's your teacher, he can be like really nice to you. I appreciate Mr. Curtis because he's always trying to help the students out and he's just generally a really great teacher. I appreciate Mrs. Maurice because she helps me with my studies and everything I need to know about math and algebra one. And I'm really happy because I understand her teaching more than I did at any other school and she explains really well and I'm grateful. So thank you. She's dope. I appreciate Mr. Post because he's more of like a scatterbrain person, like I am. And I get why, like, I get his methods and stuff. It just like the stuff he does works for me. That's why I like Mr. Post. He's a fun guy, too. He's pretty funny. He's, I like his lectures and stuff. I appreciate Mr. Post because he really cares for, for people. He really, he's helped me a lot. He's taught me a lot, and he's really tried to make my life better and teach me how to make my own life better and I appreciate that more than I think him or anyone else will ever know.